Hello everyone, it's Fan 1705 and today I'm going to take you through a tutorial on how to rename drivers on F1 2015 because so basically it's, it is actually quite simple you go into the rider language editor which I've put a link to where you download it in the description and that's what you need to be able to upload it. So I'm going to take you through it for argument, for not for argument's sake. Obviously this is, the F, this is your F1 2015 directory and then the folder you need where the language file is stored, which is where you rename the drivers, is this folder called localization. I'm not sure if the mouse is on the screen or not, but here we are. And I suggest you create a backup. I'm not actually going to save it, but I'm going to just show you how I got it working. I'm not going to actually save it yet, but or not. I'm not saying yet. I'm not going to actually save it when I do this, but you obviously know how to save and everything. And then once that's done, it works. So you obviously need language English. Obviously, if you're from a different country and you want to rename drivers, you'd have to use like a different language file. Okay, so the driver I'm. So I'm going to do a demonstration with Carlos Sainz, who I've just picked a random driver in just out of my brain. Now there's four vital things that you'd want to rename, or well, actually quite a few vital things. I'm going to take you through them all. And so just going to get, you can, you can rename those if you want, but take, I'm not going to, which would work, but I'm not going to rename them because it, because it would take quite a bit of time and it, and I'd be able to show you everything in the tutorial. Okay, so who I'm going to rename, just for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to re rename Carlos Sainz to David Williams. <laughs> I'm going to, so you, you get first, uh, the first name which is what you need to rename first. So I'm going to rename that. And then wherever the this actual part with both names are, where it says Carl Sainz. You obviously rename that. So you want you'd want to rename that. Obviously. And the other thing that you'd want to rename is this as well. And there's actually a field which would probably be under the Max Verstappen bit. Obviously, I'm not, I'm not actually going to demonstrate this, but it says M Verstappen dash C Science is how you get it to display in the actual menu when looking at the teams. So if you don't do that and it's not worked, then that's the reason why. And you think it's not worked, then you're probably wrong because you probably just forgot to do that. So obviously, naming to this bit to D Williams. <laughs> and then. The final thing you have to rename is obviously the surname. So that's five fields you'd want to rename. I'm actually going to rename the bit where it says C Science as Dash Max for Snappen. Obviously, this bit you'd have to rename to the surname of the driver. But. So just trying to find the final bit that I need to rename, wherever the M bit is. Yeah, here we are. And you'd want to rename this. And notice as I'm doing it, I'm clicking off as I do it. So you do have to do that before saving, because otherwise it will not work. Or it will not, or whatever field you're still on, will just it will just assume you haven't changed it yet. So whatever, so whatever you want, so whatever field you're still clicking on won't have changed. But anyway, that is the brief tutorial. I hope it has helped anyone who's wanting to do this. Obviously, I'm going to be using this for the Justin Sampson career mode, and anyone. And there are still spaces free. I have got quite a few drivers in the Justin Sampson series at the moment. But I'm hoping to have more. So please put a comment in the comment section if you want to enter a driver or a character that you create into the series. On Obviously just to, let, to say, 
you wouldn't actually be driving, it would be an AI driver that you'd be driving as. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope this has helped, and we'll see you for my next video. Goodbye.